Hello Duelists, it's Joe here from Rufio. Welcome to the channel. For today's Konami sponsor content, we are going to be taking a look at the brand new Speed Duel Streets of Battle City box. If you're like me and you've got incredibly fond memories of Battle City, this is definitely going to be one for you to check out. Each of these boxes contains 228 cards. All of them are usable in Speed Duel. There's 200 common cards, 20 skill cards. We've even got 8 secret rare bumps out of a total of 24 in each box. And 2 of the 8 secret rares in every box will be Slife of the Sky Dragon and Dark Magician. There's even 4 deluxe 2 player game mats featuring Yami Yugi and Arcana. So with a total of 8 decks to choose from including the likes of Yami Yugi, Joey Wheeler, Esperoba and Arcana, there's a ton of really cool options that you can play with in here. On top of that, those secret rares that we discussed earlier are going to make for some really cool rarity upgrades for some of the iconic cards in this box. There's a chance you may even get some really cool options like Yugi's Dark Magician Girl and Joey's Flame Swordsman. But that's enough waffling on from me, let's get stuck into the box. So here we have it, Duelists, the brand new Speed Duel Streets of Battle City box. Now it's absolutely no secret on this channel that I absolutely love my Speed Duel cards. So I'm really excited to get stuck into this and see some of the really cool nostalgic cards. Now I for one believe this is going to absolutely take me on a trip down memory lane. So, shall we begin? So I've already cut my tape because I'm absolutely terrible at doing it. So I definitely didn't want to do it on camera. But we're going to open the box and see exactly what we get. Okay, let's see what's inside. So we start off... Obviously, we've got Dark Magician, which is absolutely awesome. Great to see it in here. I love this artwork as well, so really cool to see that that's the one we got. I feel like this artwork represents Arcana that little bit better as well. It really is a dark-looking Dark Magician, so really cool to see that here. But we'll get into those in just a moment. The secret rares are really the most exciting part about this for a lot of people, so we'll get into those at the very end. Save the best for last and all of that. So let's see about the decks inside here and see exactly what we get. Okay, so these are playmats that were discussed earlier. I'm not going to fan them out because they're absolutely massive, especially for my camera here. So we won't be able to show you too much of those. Maybe just get a quick little sneak peek. So what we can see here is one half of the game mat. And on the other side, we can see Yugi as well. But these are our decks as discussed. So I'm going to crack through each of these and see exactly what's inside. So let's move this out the way and start with the first one. So first the decks is of course going to be Yugi, so we've got Dark Magician, Skilled Dark Magician, Alchemist of Black Spells, Blast Magician, Dark Magician Girl, Buster Blader of course, Skilled White Magician, Breaker the Magical Warrior, one of my all time favourite cards, Apprentice Magician, love this too, Magician of Faith, another absolutely classic, Old Vindictive Magician, we've got Malice Dispersion, Mage Power, Solitary Sword of Poison, Spell Power Grasp, Spell Power Grasp again, Destruction Swordsman Fusion, Miracle Restoring, Pitch Black Power Stone, Ready for Intercepting, and Dark Paladin. Absolutely must have in this deck, of course. Next up, we have Joey's deck. So we've got Gear Free the Iron Knight. We've got two copies of those Marauding Captain. We've got Time Wizard, Rocket Warrior, classic card. Little Wingard, another classic. Command Knight, I remember getting this in the tins back in the day. Really cool card. Free the Matchless General, love this card. Alligator Sword, Baby Dragon, Roulette Spider, quite cool to see this in here. Dice Foon, Graceful Dice, couldn't be without it. Polymerization. Reinforcement of the Army, another classic card. Lightning Blade, Unite will be stand, incredibly powerful. Blast with Chain, Skull Dice, Kunai with Chain, another classic you must have in here. Carbonala Warrior, Giltier the D Knight, Flame Swordsman, Alligator Sword Dragon, and of course, the legendary Thousand Dragon. Next up, we have the Rare Hunter. So we've got Red Eyes, Black Dragon, Gear Golem, the Moving Fortress, Voltic Kong, love this card, really cool. NI Parshath, absolutely classic. Dark Red Enchanter, Twin Barrel Dragon, Hannibal Necromancer, Magician of Faith, once again, Mask of Darkness, Sphere Karibo, absolutely incredible. A Ledger of the Ledger Main, Allure Darkness, Twister. Nightbeam, all that back row destruction, Nobleman of Crossout, Pineapple Blast, Metal Morph, Mishizu, I believe I pronounced that correctly, The Forceful Checkpoint, and Floodgate Trap Hole. 
Next up is Arcana's deck, Chow Sai the Ghost Stopper, Chow Len the Prophet, Anarchist Monk Ranshin, Mako Master of Barriers, Kaiku the Ghost Destroyer, and I love this card from back in the day, Legion the Fiend Jester, Double Cost on, Seal Master Mice, Dark Magician, of course, Dark Magician, of course, Anti Magic Arrows, Talisman of Trap Sealing. Dark Magic Curtain. Easy to get that Dark Magician out. Thousand Knives to punish them when you do. Dark Magic Attack to punish them when you do. Summoner's Art. Talisman of Spell Sealing. Birthright to keep bringing it back. And Dark Renewal. Next up is String. So we've got Revival Jam. Two copies of that. Humanoid Slime. Worm Drake. You already know where that's going. Reactor Slime. Mukamuka. Mukka. Enraged Mukamuka. Mukka. Magical Reflect Slime, love those slimy boys. Sinister Serpent, the Notorious, Mother Grizzly, Jam Breeding Machine, keep them coming back. And again, Emergency Provisions, Infinite Cards, Token Sunday, Polymerization, Jam Defender, Solemn Wishes, Token Stampede, and Humanoid Worm Drake. And of course, we're missing Slifer, but we already know exactly where that is. And next up, it's everyone's favourite fish guy, Mako Tsunami. We've got the Legendary Fisherman, Air Orca, Fly Fang, Needle Sunfish, Oyster Meister, Piercing Moray, Maiden of the Aqua, Fiend Kraken, Seven Coloured Fish, the Legendary Fisherman number two, Fortress Whale, Salvage, Umi, Water Hazard, Big Wave, Small Wave, Cardboard Box, Surface, Fortress Whale's Oath, Tornado Wall, Fish Depth Charge, Paleozoic, Eldonia. After that, who else could it be but Weevil Underwood? We start off with Insect Queen, Parasite Parasite, Chainsaw Insect, love this card, Magnetic Mosquito, Prickle Fairy, Howling Insect, Resonance Insect, Parasite Paranoid, Pinch Hopper, Insect Princess, Gokibor, Metal Armored Bug, Multiplication of Ants, Insect Barrier, Verdant Sanctuary, Eradicating Aerosol, Spider Egg, DNA Surgery, Dust Tornado, and Widespread Ruin. I love the artwork on this, really, really cool. And next up, it's Esper Roba, the classic Jinzo starting us off. Jinzo Lord, Jinzo Returner, keep on bringing it back. Reflect Bounder, Destructotron, Dr. Franken Derp, The Fiend Mega Cyber, Spell Canceller, Cyber Raider, Golgoyle, Cyber Energy Shock, Cosmos Channeling, Gift of the Martyr, Amplifier, Foolish Burial, Cosmic Cyclone, Creature Swap, Psychic Shockwave, Mind Crush, and Draining Shield. We have some additional cards in the box here too. We've got Summon Skull, Brain Crusher, Chaos Command Magician, Cross Sword Beetle, Gear Free the Red Eyes Iron Knight, Goblin Attack Force, Maiden of the Macabre, Magical Marionette, Pump Princess, the Princess of Ghosts, Red Eyes, Baby Dragon, Reversible Beetle, Warrior of Atlantis, Zero the Mant, Acid Rain, Book of Tayu, Exchange, Last Day of Witch, Megaton Magical Cannon, Zero Ritual, Barrel Behind the Door, Exhausting Spell, Magical Arm Shield, Blowback Dragon, Dark Scorpion Mene the Thorn, Dark Scorpion Gorg the Strong, Skilled, Red Magician, A Legendary Ocean, Book of Moon, Fusion Weapon, Hammer Shot, Lost Wind, Metal Reflect Slime, and Wall of Disruption. Then onto our skill cards duelist. If you do want to get a good look at these, please pause the video and see exactly what they have on there. Otherwise, we will be here for an eternity reading through all of these skills for you. So we start with Ultimate Wizardry, that's Yami Yugi, Iron Grit for Joey. Whale of a Tail for Mako Tsunami. Infect Infestation for Weevil. Intel from the Cosmos for Esper Roba. Stalked by the Rare Hunter Hunters. That's Rare Hunter. Now you see them for Arcana. Slimy Slimes for Strings. The Dragon Hunting Swordsman for Yami Yugi. 
Heart of a Warrior for Joey. A Bountiful Ocean for Mako. My Precious Queen for Weevil. The Machine Menace for Esperoba. Collector for Rare Hunter. A Terrible Fate for Arcana. Slimy Disposition for Strings. Lovely. Malicious Motivation for Joey. Kyber Court Research for Kyber. Battle City Siren for Mai. And Premature Material for Bones. And now on to the final part of the video. We have our secret rare. So let's see exactly what's inside. We already know about Dark Magician, obviously, because it's on the front here. But let's see what else we get. So we have Dark Magician, of course, looking absolutely awesome. Beautiful secret rare. And I love the artwork. We have Sly for the Sky Dragon. Of course, we knew we would get this in here. Widespread Ruin looking absolutely crisp with that artwork. I love this artwork variant. And of course, the Secret Rare looks incredible. Marauding Captain in Secret Rare. Again, one of my all-time favorite cards. Beautiful to see this in here. From I used to love playing this in my Warrior decks back in the day. Flame Swordsman looking absolutely crisp in that Secret Rare. Beautiful upgrade. Very, very cool to see it in here. We've got Dark Magician again. The alternate artwork or the original artwork, depending on how you look at it. Nice Secret Rare here looking absolutely crisp. Dark Magicka, a nice Secret Rare there. And for our final one, we have Summoned Skull looking absolutely awesome in that beautiful Secret Rare foiling. Really, really cool upgrade to have available. But that all is all for today's video. A massive thank you to Konami for hooking me up with the box for today's opening. And thank you to all for making it this far into the video. Hopefully, by virtue of the fact that you have, you can sit and subscribe and maybe even the notification bell so you don't miss out on great Yu-Gi-Oh! content in future. If you're as hyped as I am for Speed Duel Streets of Battle City, it's not long to wait now. The date to mark down is the 24th of August. Put it in your diary, put it in your calendar, set a notification on your phone, whatever you need to do to make sure you don't miss the moment that this drops. Once again, that's all from me. Thank you very much for coming along. I do appreciate you being here, and I will see you in the next one.